The man convicted of killing a Milwaukee attorney back in 2020 will spend 25 years in prison. Stephanie Haynes live now at the courthouse where Theodore Edgecombe this afternoon learned his sentence. Stephanie. Right, Steve, that's 25 years initial confinement and 12 years extended supervision. That's the sentence the judge handed Theodore Edgecombe, which is not the maximum penalty in this case. The sentencing hearing this afternoon lasted a few hours and the courtroom was packed full of family and friends of Jason Clearman and Theodore Edgecombe, both of which spoke to the judge. Jason Clearman's wife asked for the maximum sentence and family of Theodore Edgecombe pleaded with the judge to show mercy. This all happened back in September 2020 near Holton and Brady Streets following an argument on the road. And since then, Theodore Edgecombe has claimed self-defense, but a jury convicted him of first degree reckless homicide back in January. Today in court, the judge made it clear that if Edgecombe didn't have a gun on him that night, this never would have happened. Then again, ultimately, Mr. Edgecombe, there was no need whatsoever, even if, and yes, Mr. Clearman was striding towards you, for you to pull a gun and within a matter of a couple of seconds, put a bullet in his skull. Edgecombe has 20 days to file an appeal, and you will he hear much more from the speakers at today's sentencing later tonight at 10. For now, live in Milwaukee, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News.